Hello everyone, my name is Sutton the Wolf, and welcome back to Oh Sir, the Insult Simulator. So last time, I had two arguments about the same dead Norwegian blue parrot, apparently, and uh, we found out that Mr. John Shufflebottom is really shit at this. So I am going to be Sir Knight again, and uh, instant argument. Let's get going. Yes, Sir Knight. Sir Knight, at your... Sir Knight, at your service. Alright, where are we gonna go now? So we already did the pet shop, that's where we argued about the Norwegian blue. Alright, we got the train compartment. We can go by the lake. Okay, it looks like that's all we got. Um, let's go to the train compartment. I can only imagine what we're gonna argue about there. Excuse okay. me, I believe this is my seat. Your seat? Does it have your name on it? I don't think so, but I have a ticket. First class, eh? You don't look like a first class to me. Ooh. <laughs> All right, Mrs. Maggie, I lost you last time. Let's see how this goes. Okay. Uh, getting right into it. Um, let's see. You. Start off easy. Some dog smells of. Okay. Um, you. Uh. You are rude. Sure. Oh, I mean, it's true. I gotta say, I love their voices. Like the, you smell like a whatever. I don't even know. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, you are rude. Um, and I guess I'll try for that dance like, maybe dance like your sister. Um, and dance like, uh... Do I want to risk it, or do I want to actually... I'll risk it. Let's try and get another one. Shit. Um. Shit. Fuck. Well, I'm screwed. Some dog smells of your house. Damn it. Uh, you are rude and dance like... Um, your hovercraft. Alright. Okay, so that gives me more time to think, I guess. Okay, I didn't realize I could do that. Um. Alright, I guess I'll keep that. Damn it, that's gonna let her get a whole bunch of insults, though. Man, this is actually, like, a little bit harder than I thought it was going to be. Like, I thought I was just gonna be, like, sling... Well, I guess I am just slinging insults around, but... wanted to be your cousin's car. Okay, good. That's not a very good insult. You are rude and dance like your hovercraft. Yeah, that's not bad. All right, that kind of caught up a bit. All right, so can, seeing as she's going first here, I'm kind of losing. Uh, let's go for a your mother. Those usually work really well. All right, uh, your mother um has bad breath, and then I could say and was defeated by. Mmm. Let me figure out what I'm gonna do here. Um. And. Has bad breath, and I guess I'll say wear secondhand clothes. That should probably work. Your seat acts like. What? Okay, that's easy. Your, your mother has bad breath and wears secondhand clothes. Ha! Your mother has bad breath and wears secondhand clothes. Yeah, now we're in business. Acts like this train. Oh. Yeah, that's wimpy. You ain't got nothing on this. All right. Um, let's see. Your wife. Generally, the your whatever comments seem to do pretty well. Like the your mother, your sister, your brother. All right, your wife. Um, let's see. Uh. Hmm. Uh, is stone dead? Um. Uh. I guess. And admires pictures of your seat? I'll try it. Ah, shit. Um. Let's. Stalked. Ugh. This isn't good. Um. Okay, so if I remember, if I do this correctly, I can use this 
to spend time to think. And so that'll let me actually this get more. Sits next to your seat. What? How does that actually... How does that actually do anything bad? That isn't offensive at all. Okay, so now I'll be able to... Your wife is stone dead and stalked... Um... The Nazis. Yes. Alright, what else can I do here? Uh... Um... Let's see. Can I... Can I... Let's try and combo this. I'm gonna get another and in there. Don't you dare take that has a steaming romp with. There we go. Your wife is stone dead and stalked the Nazis and has a steaming romp with a hamster. Glorious. Alright, that should work really well. Sister secretly adores this train. That doesn't make any sense. Alright. That's right. Let's do this. Your wife is stone dead and stalked the Nazis and has a steaming romp with a hamster. That better be good. Rude. Ouch. 20. Your yeah. Secretly adores this train. Ugh. Yeah, she's not even hitting the double digits. I've got, I think I've got this in the bag. All right. Um, I already talked about a wife, so let's talk about a husband. Well, yeah, yeah, we'll go with a husband because we got all the ones that are like secretly <laughs> adores, doesn't like, stone dead. All right, your husband. Uh, is not interesting. Then I'll try and take an and, and then I'll get a coffee or tea rather. Sorry. Um. I'll take the and from her, so she can't use it. Let's see. Your husband is not interesting, and... Can use this. Um, has not so much brain as earwax. Nice. Not seen that one yet. I like that a lot. I love how it's still a male, a male kind of sign thing, where it's like the... Ah, even though it's Mrs. Maggie, like a clearly a female character. All right. Um. Uh. That that should do it. Your husband is not interesting and has not so much brain as earwax. Oh. Yeah, that's right. Doesn't like your seat. See, she she doesn't have anything. She's getting these dinky little four and fives and like maybe eight, but like I'm totally getting this. Ooh, your sense of style. This should hurt. This should hurt. All right, your sense of style. Um, what? Ooh, let's see what else I can get. Um, was born in a stewed prune. I don't know if that's any good, but we'll see. Your sense of style was born in. Um, a stewed prune and worked with your sister. Let's see if I can get that. Damn it. Um, yeah, since she took the end, I'll have to keep it there. That should be... I don't think that'll be enough to get rid of her, but I think next, between this and next round, I should have plenty to be able to get her. My health is still pretty dang high. Ooh. Not exactly correct grammar. Oh, actually, yeah, that does do correct grammar. That's not bad. Okay. Your sense of style was born in a stewed prune. Oh my gosh! Wow, that was terrible. All right. Um. All right. Let's go back to the tried and true. The, your your husband. Your husband. The African swallow. It's an African or a European swallow. <laughs> all right. Um, your husband, alright, um, dances like, if I do dances like, I will, well, I'll do can't dance, and then I'll try and grab that and. It's so hard, like, whenever you have the, there's, there's not necessarily many grammatically correct answers. Your husband can't dance, and is an ill-nurtured way face. Nice. I'm gonna take that. We'll have to see if I can drink some tea and get a combo off of that. Your husband can't dance and is an ill-nurtured wayface. Wayface. Way. I always, where have I heard that before? Way. What is way? I can't remember. Um, wayface. 
Um. That'll have to do it. That should be enough. Can't dance and is an ill-nurtured wayface. Oh, yeah. African swallow dances like your country. I was gonna say that's that's the worst one I've seen. I'm not a first class myself. I just wanted to see how it felt, and it certainly was worth it. Oh, forget it. I won't sit where your filthy bottom was. Ooh, nice. All right. All right. Well, that's going better. I think I'm getting better at this. <laughs> All right. Let's try this again. I got time. All right. Let's let's keep it up with Sir Knight. He's been doing us pretty well. I never actually read this before. Kids these days. TV, rap music, video games. He has more important matters on his mind than keeping up with infantile new technology, fashion, and language. Reading Shakespeare's latest book, Winding Clocks. Treating his urinary incontinence. But everything changes when he realizes that kids look jealously at his old-fashioned clothes. At that moment, he decides to become a hipster. Okay, so is this like a weakness sort of thing? He can't keep up with modern times. Huh. Okay. I wonder if that, like... I wonder if that means that if I come into some sort of situation with, like, a kid or something, then it'll, like... I won't have as many good responses. Or maybe, like, the grammar wouldn't match up necessarily. I wonder if there's, like, some some form of fixed proponent with their weaknesses. I'm sure there is, if they're actually listed. Okay, so the only one we have left is the by the lake scenario, so let's do that. I wonder who I'm... Okay, Mrs. Maggie, you are really having my number here. Of course not. I just borrowed it to put my teacup on. What the fuck? murdered this poor man to have tea on his rotting corpse. What? How could I murder him when I was hiding in a shrubbery with my rifle hole? What the fuck? <laughs> you might have a perfect alibi, but what? you can't deny <laughs> The alibi is far from perfect. <laughs> Alright. Let's set you straight, woman. Oh, man, I mean, you kind of look like a man now that I look... See it, but who am I to judge, honestly? All right. Um, okay, I gotta go. Uh, you. Okay, what can I do here? You... Homeless man socks. That's a new one. You... Um, well, there's the probably murder. You probably murdered... Uh, I think I might have screwed myself here. Um, probably murdered... Your son. Okay, that helps. All right. I didn't see what that other one was. I'll have to look at that. And your hovercraft. Okay. You probably murdered your son. Um. Uh, that's all I can really do. Damn it. Oh well. That's not terrible. We'll see. Yeah. Don't get anything. The not. Well, it's kind of a good thing that we don't like the Nazis, right? Like, I mean, just saying. I was gonna say, it's not very you good. Probably murdered your son. Yeah! Short and simple, but it works. Damn it, she took the she took the your mother. Oh man, is there any Oh man? Alright, I guess I'm taking this lake. Oh, I could have done this conversation. This lake. Um Damn it. Shit. I guess I'll say can't exercise because of this conversation. Damn it! God, fuck you! God damn it! Um. Oh god, damn it! Uh, shit! I don't want to get off for grammar, so I'm just gonna have to cut my losses here. Damn it! That's really annoying. Ugh. Oh, don't, don't you start. Oh, damn it. Oh, that's really good. Oh, shut up. Okay. And Your face. And go yeah, that's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. Oh, God, no. Oh, man. Oh, I'm getting screwed. Oh, man, no, that's terrible. Um... Uh, okay. Let's see if I can bring this back. Your mother has worse hair than a platypus. I'll try for that. Right. Your mother has worse hair than a platypus and will soon kick the bucket. Alright. Has worse hair than a platypus. 
Alright, and then I'll try and drink some tea and see if I can get anything. Your country is you, that means nothing. Alright, your mother was worse than a platypus. And... Ooh. Uh, okay. There's, I've got options. Your country is you, mate! <laughs> Alright, that means... Okay, I might be able to bring this back actually. Actually. Um... Uh... We'll soon kick... Oh no, we'll always be alone. Let's do that. Um... What else do I got? Uh... That, that should do it. Alright. I'll go for that. Your mother has worse hair than a platypus, and will always be alone. Yeah! Well, okay, it's not as good as I thought it'd be. How is that an 11? That's bullshit! God, this is stacked, I swear. Your math teacher? Okay. Um, your beloved auntie. Yeah, that's right. Okay, what, what do I got here? I need to get some options here. I need to catch up. I'm, I'm losing pretty fucking bad. Alright, your beloved auntie, um, uh, secretly adores your father. I'll try for that. I love how we're just arguing over this dead man's corpse. And just, we, his, his hat, I didn't even realize. I thought those were like wooden things, but his, it looks like his hands. Oh, oh, crap, I actually have to, damn it, took your father. Secretly adores your sense of style? That doesn't really work, but I have to. I can't help but do this accent whenever I'm playing this game. It's so funny. I love this game so much. Um... And... Is Stone dead? Let's try that. Let's try that. Your beloved auntie secretly adores your sense of style. And is Stone dead? Right. That's good. Uh, Still not enough, though. Into your father. I was gonna say that doesn't make too much sense. I'm slowly bringing it back, but I'm I'm per I'm still. Ooh, poses nude for. Um, you. Ooh, your face. All right, all right. Your face poses nude for. Or no, is dull and ugly. Dull and ugly. Um. It's dull and ugly, and. Let's see. Hmm. <sighs> has not so. Nice. Your face is dull and ugly, and has not so much a brain as earwax. Nice. Alright. Let's try that. Face is dull, dull and, and ugly, and has, has not so much, much brain as, as earwax. Oh, oh man, only a nine. Acts like you. So, you know, well, it, eh? the fu what? Oh, come on, that didn't even sound very good. Damn it, I might actually lose this. Well, sister, okay. Um. Oh, nice. Alright, I'm gonna go with your beloved auntie. Your beloved auntie smells of your cousin's car. Alright, I'm gonna go for it. Come on. Don't you dare to- Fuck! Damn it. Smells of- Fuck, I have to get rid of that. Damn it. Ah! I have to think on it. Damn it! Ah, it's so frustrating. All right, shut up. Just get it. Get on with it. You're gonna kick my ass. Come on, get done with it. Your sister and your cousin's car wanted to be the African swallow. Oh, I'm not dead yet. Mm. All right, so I'm still thinking. Mm. All right, um. Um, your beloved auntie smells of. Someone insane. Um. Oh, if I don't. Oh, she's probably gonna get this. Your beloved auntie smells of someone insane. And. Damn it, she took the was defeated by. Um. Ah. Uh, has tiny feet? Alright, let's see if I can get an end with the. 
something. I might. I need. I need a bit of luck here. Tiny feet. That's. Uh, I have to go for that. That's all I can do. Yeah. There's no way I'm gonna win. Oh, shut up with your face like that. Your tongue isn't even that long. It's like a little snake. Oh God. Auntie smells of someone insane and has tiny feet. Oh, Damn it. I confess, it was me who what? murdered this man. I, I didn't. need his train ticket. Direct what? connection, first class. Oh. First class? Then killing him for the ticket is understandable. <laughs> please, try to restrain from murder in the future. Are we just going to ignore this? This game is ridiculous. Alright, well... I'm going to get back and try and do that, but that'll be in the next episode. So for now, thank you for tuning in once again to Oh Sir, the Insult Simulator. My name is Sutton the Wolf, and I will see you guys next time. Oh! Hey, what's up, Nick? What? <laughs> I didn't realize we're recording. Oh, no, you're good.